Hello everybody. In today's video, we travel to Texas to board a container ship. In this video, I will give you a brief tour of the bridge and show the cargo operations. Hope you enjoyed the video. Today I'm back in Texas at a container terminal to attend a container vessel. And boy, am I glad it is Sunday because normally on a weekday, this place is absolutely chaos, dangerous. I get anxious the night before I come here. The trucks that are driving around here drive like madmen. Cranes are crossing the road. It is just absolutely insane. But on a Sunday, it's not so bad being here. Whenever I actually get on board the vessel, I'll get some really good footage of the cranes loading and unloading the containers. But the job I'm actually doing on board, I'm not actually allowed to talk about, so. But I will get as much footage on board the vessel as possible and being on board the container ships is a pretty neat experience. They're a little bit different than all the regular cargo ships. Well, there is my patient for the day. The ship is carrying approximately 5,000 containers and these cranes will load and unload pretty much all the 5,000 containers in less than 24 hours and then the ship will be on its way again. There is one of the containers being loaded on board as we speak. The ship currently has three cranes operating on it at the same time. They use a very sophisticated computer program that tells them where to stack the containers so they're able to come off in the correct order at the next port. Yeah, here's another truck pulling up. You can see how fast these containers are actually being loaded. Look further down the terminal. It's a fairly large ship. I'll be on board soon. See you there. Another lucky thing about today is most ships do not have elevators. Or if they do, they do not work. And today this ship has an elevator and it's also working. And as you can see, this is a very tall ship and I am glad the elevator is working. It may not be the fastest, but it's better than carrying all these tools up and down the stairs. So I'm a happy camper. But look at this escape hatch. I'm not exactly huge, but there's no way I'm fitting through there. Well, this is the bridge of a container vessel. And here we have the container crane very close by, taking the container off. This is gonna be some really good footage here. Yeah, let's follow this sucker. Typical bridge, consoles, uh, dual radars. Uh, this one actually has captain and chairs next to the conning station. The massive steering wheel, dual radars, ECTUS, GPS and AIS systems. And let's take a look at, at the containers on board the vessel. There's over 5,000 containers on board this ship. We'll walk out onto the bridge wing. You can see other ships coming down the channel way off in the distance. And we're actually really high in the air. I'm guessing we're close to 100 feet above the water at this point. Not good if you're afraid of heights. Here comes a tow boat. The area that is coming from is super restricted area. You're not allowed to fish up there. We'll take a quick look on top of Monkey Island. Monkey Island is what you call the roof of the bridge. Okay, we're now on top of Monkey Island and another container is being picked up as we speak. We'll get a bird's eye view of this one. That's some pretty scary stuff, actually. I'm getting back. <laughs> the 
two white domes you see here uh, are where the VSAT antennas are. This is how the vessel receives internet when they're at sea. Anytime you're on the bridge of a vessel, there will always be something beeping. In this case, we have an emergency message coming in on the Emersat C unit, but it doesn't apply to this vessel, so I'm just gonna clear it. Ah, peace. <laughs> and just in case you don't know your left from your right, they have it documented. <laughs> This is so cool. Wow. Very cool. I think that container weighs approximately 67,000 pounds. And away it goes. The clip plane now of the container being removed is my favorite one in this entire video. If you have made it to this point in the video, please comment below the country and city that you live in, as I think it will be very interesting for myself and the other viewers watching this video. What you are seeing right now is a visual representation of the United States trade deficit. There are literally thousands and thousands and thousands of containers full of junk that we probably don't need from China. Just like that, the port is completely quiet because it is lunchtime. I'm getting off the ship at the perfect time. It's a lot of containers. My job here is now complete. Now all I have left to do is find myself out of this maze to get back to the highway. But one thing is nice, being that it is lunchtime, it's so peaceful. Normally I'm stressed out the night before I have to come to this terminal just because these trucks drive like mad men. And I don't really know where I'm going so I get honked at a lot. Anyway, I hope everybody enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. There will be more to come as I attend more vessels on a daily basis. Signing off.